In this video, I'm going to go over how to scan forms into the Remark application. So the first thing that we're going to do on our desktop is just create a folder where all the data is going to go. So I'm going to right-click and do New Folder. I'm just going to call this Psych 1 Exam 1. Okay. And then I'm going to uh, open the Test Grading folder. And here's all the resources that we need for test grading. And double-click on Remark Office 8. In the meantime, I'm going to make sure my scanner's on but just by hitting the power button so the green light should be on. I'm going to take all my exams. Um, actually, I'm going to do these in two batches. Uh, you can do about 40 sheets at one time. So I'm going to take the exams, hold them upright, turn them to face them away, and then just put them into the, uh, into the feeder. And then this thing can be up or down just to collect the, collect the pages as they come out. So uh, if you get a Outlook 2007 startup, uh, window the first time you use this, just click cancel and you can say yes to exit and you won't get that again. Um, I'm going to click on open form templates and then the template that we're looking for is UCSD Psych 100 multiple choice. So it may show up uh, as a recent option if you've already done this before but otherwise you click on browse and it's right here. So I'm going to double click on that. So I've now uh, told it essentially what what this form looks like and now we actually want to read the forms in. So I'm going to click on Read Wizard and I don't have to do anything on this first page so I'll click Next. On the second page I want to tell it where to put all the all the data. So I'm going to click on this ellipsis and go up to my desktop. I'm going to close my computer so I can see everything and then click on Psych 1 Exam 1 and say OK. And where it says Begin Images uh, image names with, I'm going to change to all the way towards the top of the list, last four digits. And click on next. And I don't have to do anything on this third screen, so I can click on read. So it's going to read the forms in. Uh, if it runs out of forms and you need to new, do another batch, it says, do you want to continue scanning? You can say yes. If you get this error, it says no paper. You can just put your form in if you still have some, otherwise click cancel if you're done. So I'm going to click on retry. It's going to keep going. And I'm all done scanning, so I'm going to click no. I'm now going to save data. And um, don't save it in this data folder that it initially suggests. You need to save it in your test folder. So go back to your desktop and Psych 1 Exam 1. And I'm just going to call this Psych 1 Exam 1 Data. 